Hey guys, I found another body for my uh, my Nico Trans Am RC car. Now this particular chassis was made in 1985, made in Singapore. The other Pontiac Trans Am body was made in Japan in 1986. But anyways, I found an alternate body for this uh, RC car. This one came from a Nico uh, from the Nico Car Crusher uh, series, and that was set on a monster truck. It came with a truck body and this uh, Trans Am body here. So when I was looking at it, I was like, wait a minute, that is probably the same mold that they used for the uh, for the Nico Trans Am. So I bought the body, I took it off the monster truck chassis, and then I set it on my, my Pontiac Trans Am chassis, and it's a perfect fit. And just as I suspect, suspected, it's the same, it's the same mold as the Trans Am body, but they added this giant uh, engine scoop to it, engine blower. So, that's fun. Now, uh, my chassis here, this is the, uh, the 1985 chassis made in Singapore. There's another Pontiac Trans Am that's made in 1986 in Japan. But they're pretty much the same thing. So look at that. This is, it looks really sweet with this uh, with this body on it. It's different than the black than the black Trans Am body. Now these batteries are not one hundred percent. I love I love the way the thing drives. It drives so so smoothly. Uh oh, my range. Hey, you don't have to literally call it. You can just uh, move the camera side to side. Yeah, these batteries are pretty much have it. Uh, uh. Well, okay, I think the batteries pretty much have it. But let me show you what the uh, body looks like. So I, I didn't even screw this in. So here is the the body, and again, this was made for an RC monster truck. The other the other body for that truck was an actual truck body. But there's also a uh, the Trans Am body, and I'm probably gonna take off this engine blower and uh, make some changes to it. But that's what that looks like. All right, so all right, so I took off the uh, the the engine blower. If you want to look at that real quick, <laughs> and I'm gonna try to have that filled up later on. But as for now, I took it off. It's weird. Sometimes this thing dries well, sometimes it doesn't. Uh-oh. Out of range. There you go. But it's just a nice uh, alternate body. But I do plan to have this th thing repainted, and then uh, I do want to fill up that, that opening in the hood. I think it looks like a vintage Trans Am body. Not like this uh, racing style decal type deal. And yeah, with new batteries, this will run faster. Because you know, you've seen my other video where this thing drives pretty fast. Alright, guys, well, I just wanted you to see that.